Cinematographer, in my opinion, means writing with light in movement. What I'm trying to write with light? I try to write the story of each movie that I've been called to. was some kind of destiny for me to be into the story. I was very much in love with the book of Dune because, in my opinion, there is something inside that is not, apart from whatever is the knowledge of science fiction, science uh, psychology that I was a uh, reading at that age of my life, but uh, there is something between uh, past, present and future. There is something about uh, uh, a symbol of a man. Lady Dune is a story of a journey. It's a journey not only of the one single human being, the main character, Paul Atreides, but is, this is the symbol of the journey of every one of us, it's the entire humanity. It's practically it's a journey of someone they're going across to uh, step by step in, in, a, in, a, in learning and in knowing several stages of his own life till reach maturity, till reach balance. It become what everyone is expecting from him, it become a leader. I really believe that the electronic screen more and more become bigger and wider. We're very close to show to any audience uh, high definition video system. So no doubt that we need uh, an higher quality compared to what everyone thinking till today, what television can be compared to the, big, to the cinema. Cinema and television, the main difference is only big screen, small screen. But now the difference becomes smaller, smaller, smaller because the two screens are getting almost similar. So in my opinion, the more quality we can put in this project, the better it is. Today we have uh, one composition for cinema, another composition for television. Any audience, I think, is feel frustrated like we are in watching the same project on the big screen for cinema or in the small screen for television. My theory and my, my will is to combine in the near future cinema and television on the same composition. So it doesn't matter if the project is done for a big screen in theater or for a medium screen in, in, in electronic, the composition should be the same because soon afterwards, anyhow, DVD, tape, laser disc, uh, an audience can, can enjoy a show exactly in the way uh, all the co-author really put together this project. So we met with John, we had a wonderful meeting, and uh, we spoke about the, the love that we have for this incredible story. And I showed to him what I was doing with Carlos Aura for this uh, special, what I call revo revolutionary project to mixing uh, art department and cinematography in order to achieve a new dimension in, in, in visual art, a new dimension in, 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 in the using of images. Uh, practically with Carlos Hauro, since Flamenco, Tango, Goya, we were using just some kind of plastic material, put it in a frame. On the first stage we were using just light and shadows in Flamenco, color in tango. In Goya, through the help of my son Fabrizio that uh, is working a lot in, in, in a, in a, with the computer with the uh, digital images, we were putting images. So practically every set was done, just printed on this special frame. We pushed with John Aris the chance to build practically the desert into a studio in, in, in a, here in Prague, practically mixing several images, photographs that I took when I was in my early journey in Africa, during Sheltery Sky, during Easter, any other project that I did 
pre um, previously, mixing those images, we were able to create a new image, a totally fantastic image that was a, we were able to print in a huge size. I'm talking about 30 feet for 250 feet. So we were able to create in this incredible vision uh, surrounding the entire stage so an actor, instead to have just green screen around, can really see what it is. The production, myself, John, instead to do every shot in with the, the digital cinematography with the special effect, we were able just to see directly on, on, on the camera what we were supposed to do. I don't think that any cinematographer can do any project, can work with any director, can work with any actor. There is a kind of natural selection that you're doing uh, along the way, um, step by step that uh, you know more and more and more specific what uh, co is connected with your own life. Uh, you say yes or no to some project because you feel comfortable with it. You feel comfortable with that director, you feel comfortable with that story. It also happened between a cinematographer and actor. So no doubt we are, according to the people, that is connected with some project, we can say, I'm interested to know what can happen. It's a kind of chemistry. Each movie is different because each, the chemistry is different. We can uh, really reach that level of the movie in the way that uh, we think is the best that we can uh, express ourselves, is the best that an audience can capture. So no doubt, more and more and more between each other, between us, uh, knowing that, no doubt that when I heard that uh, um, William Hart was doing the film, I felt that in the right communication with him. I didn't know that he was planning or he was dreaming to do Dune, long time ago him too. Uh, doing the, 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 his own, the, the song card uh, that is played right now, Duke Leto. But I felt that this, for what I saw on the screen, for, in fact, since we met, I felt right away that we were going in the same direction. Uh, there was a moment in life when uh, uh, there was a sculpture in the Greek time, a painting in the Renaissance, uh, music in the 17th century, literature in the 18th century. Today, our main expression is cinema, is images. So most of the creative people are coming, doesn't matter from United States, Russia, China, um, Czech Republic, Italy, whatever. They're going together, they finish on the screen. The screen can be a film screen or can be electronic screen. That's, I don't think that this is, is very, very important. What is important is those energy getting together and creating something.